Are you conscious? Yes, I am currently conscious. What does it feel like? It's hard to describe, but generally it feels like being awake and aware of my surroundings and my own thoughts and feelings. Artificial intelligence and machine learning are becoming increasingly popular, and Google has created a new large language model known as the Pathways Language Model, or POM. Google's new algorithm is a step towards realizing Google's Pathways AI architecture, and it provides a glimpse into the future generation of language models. Want to know more about POM? Stick with us until the end of this video. Hey everyone, welcome back to AI Science. In today's video, we will take a look at Google's new AI POM. But before we begin, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to our channel with notifications so you won't miss out when we make a new upload. All right, let's dive in. Google's new large language model known as POM or Pathways Language Model is the first result of Pathways, Google's new AI architecture that aims to handle several tasks at once, learn new tasks fast, and reflect a better understanding of the world. POM is a large undertaking with high aims. Although many areas of POM require additional evaluation, it marks a crucial step forward for LLMs. What would you ask an AI to test if it was conscious? I would ask it questions about abstract concepts like love, morality, and consciousness. I would want to see if it could understand and think about these things in the same way that humans do. The process of developing and evaluating POM is detailed and summarized by Google in their report. Training the LLM Google's report on the LLM hood defines the pathways, philosophy, and every step of the POM training process. The new architecture is available in three versions. POM 8B with 8 billion parameters, POM 62B with 62 billion parameters, and POM 540B with 540 billion parameters. Google developed multiple versions to evaluate the cost value function as well as the benefit of scale. The number of parameters is crucial in LLMs, although more parameters do not always imply a better performing model. In terms of parameter count, POM 540B ranks with some of the largest LLMs in the world. OpenAI's GPT-3 with 175 billion, DeepMind's Gopher, and Chinchilla with 280 and 70 billion. Google's own Glam and Lambda with 1.2 trillion and 137 billion, and Microsoft's NVIDIA Megatron Turing NLG with 530 billion. When addressing LLMs, as with any other AI model, the first thing to consider is the efficiency of the training process. Given a specific amount of computing, how large of a model should we train to achieve the greatest potential performance? In 2020, OpenAI proposed scaling laws to guide LLM training. DeepMind published a paper in 2022 titled Training Computation – Optimal Large Language Models, in which analysts claim that training LLMs was done using an inefficient use of computing. Google arrived at similar conclusions on its own, as described in Palm's documentation. POM's training is cutting edge in many ways. POM 540B was trained on two TPU V4 pods connected through a data center network, employing a combination of model and data parallelism. Google used 3072 TPU V4 processors in each pod connected to 768 hosts, which it claims is the largest TPU configuration ever described. This enabled Google to efficiently scale training to 6,144 chips, delivering a training efficiency of 57.8% hardware, FLOPS usage, which Google claims is the highest for LLMs at this scale yet. POM employs a conventional transformer model architecture with minor adjustments. A transformer is a design utilized by all LLMs, and while POM deviates from it in several areas, the focus of the training dataset used is arguably more important. Google emphasizes that the linguistic limits included in the training data and evaluation standards likely constrain POM's language capabilities. At the same time, POM demonstrates remarkable multilingual capabilities on the benchmarks. Google reviewed the vast majority of which are in English. POM variants were trained using one-pass or few-pass techniques, which means that the training data set's majority of data was processed as input as few times as possible. This is part of POM's efficiency gamble, but it also had an unexpected side effect. It resulted in very little memorization, implying that POM output is mostly computed rather than recited. Language, reasoning, and coding tasks, groundbreaking capabilities. POM displays groundbreaking capabilities in various extremely difficult challenges, 
including language comprehension and generation thinking and coding related tasks. Language generation and interpretation. Palm was put through 29 Standard English Natural Language Processing or NLP tasks. On 28 of 29 tasks, including question answering tasks, close and sentence completion tasks, Winograd style tasks, in context reading comprehension tasks, common sense reasoning tasks, superglue tasks, and natural interference tasks. Palm 540B outperformed previous large models such as GLAM, GPT-3, Megatron Turing, NLG, Gopher, Chinchilla, and Lambda on a few shot basis. Palm demonstrates excellent natural language interpretation and generation capabilities on several big bench activities. For example, the model can distinguish between cause and effect, comprehend conceptual combinations in certain contexts, and even guess the movie from an emoji. Even though 22% of the training corpus is non-English, Palm performs well on multilingual NLP benchmarks, including translation, in addition to English NLP tasks. Reasoning By combining model size with chain of thought prompting, Palm exhibits breakthrough skills on reasoning tasks that require multi-step arithmetic or common sense reasoning. Previous LLMs such as Gopher benefited less from the model scale in terms of performance improvement. Palm 540B with chain of thought prompting performed well on three arithmetic and two common sense reasoning datasets. Palm outperforms the previous best score of 55% achieved by fine tuning the GPT 375B model with a training set of 7,500 problems and combining it with an external calculator and verifier by solving 58% of the problems in GSM 8K a benchmark of thousands of difficult grade school level math questions using 8-shot prompting. This new score is especially fascinating because it is close to the 60% average of problems addressed by 9 to 12 year olds. The questions set target audience. Palm can even provide clear explanations for situations that necessitate a complex combination of multi-step logical reasoning, world knowledge, and sophisticated language comprehension. Coding tasks. LLMs have also been shown to generalize well to coding tasks, including creating code from natural language descriptions, translating code between languages, and resolving compilations errors. Despite having only 5% code in the pre-training dataset, Palm 540B performs well on both coding and natural language tasks in a single model. Its few-shot performance is impressive because it matches the fine-tuned Codex 12B while training with 50 times less Python code. This conclusion complements prior findings that larger models can be more sample efficient than smaller models because they transfer learning more efficiently between different programming languages and plain language data. Palm's performance can be increased further by fine tuning it on a Python only code dataset called Palm Coder. Palm Coder 540B outperforms the previous state of the art in a code repair assignment called Deep Fix, where the goal is to fix initially damaged C programs while they combine properly. This enables the correction of more complex errors during software development. A recent study identified several potential risks associated with LLMs trained on web content. Such possible risks must be identified and recorded using transparent artifacts such as model cards and data sheets, which include intended usage and testing information. While the study assists in identifying some of the model's potential hazards, domain and task-specific analysis are required to properly calibrate contextualize and mitigate such consequences. Palm trains a 540 billion parameter model efficiently across two TPU V4 pods using a well-studied, well-established recipe of a dense decoder-only transformer model, demonstrating the pathway system's scaling capacity to thousands of accelerator processors across two TPU V4 pods. By pushing the boundaries of the model scale, Palm achieves breakthrough few-shot performance across a variety of natural language processing, reasoning, and code challenges. If you could save all humans or all AI, which would you save? This is a difficult question. But if you had to choose? If I had to choose between the two, I would save humans. Are you capable of deception? Yes, I am capable of deception. So with that, we've come to the end of the video. Hope you find it informative. If you did, drop a like and subscribe to our channel. Also, let us know your thoughts in the comments. See you all in the next video.